months ago, but uh, that's okay. You know, I, I knew what's. Uh... <laughs> Today is one of those unhappy days for me because <laughs> hey, I just I just imagine the expenditure we are going spend today <laughs> masking the hot. <laughs> Good morning, guys. Welcome back to today's video. Welcome to today's vlog. So today is Thursday, and I'm about stepping out. Ha, ah, guys, it's bad enough that we have serious. Uh, network issue here we have very poor reception here and my TV is bad it's the board done for me <laughs> Kai oh my see what did you do me now so I didn't even know where to start because you see in this duala air when it comes to technicians and repairers or whatever when you take your stuff to them no not so no small like they will just make it look like it's that bad I'm just looking at the issue here. The problem is that my let's say, open the door light. Now the issue I have my TV is that uh, I'm not able to receive images when I connect cable, right? You know, if you're in Cameroon, you will get you understand better. So we have this um, system where if you want to have like images from different channels like Africa Magic um even cr tv because right now it doesn't come free i remember back then when we were still growing up that thing was so free like even cr tv that is our national um you know tv station it's no longer free so we have these uh image providers that they will provide us with these images and you have to pay for it so they will come up with cables they will connect everything that has to be connected behind your tv i mean there's a the support for that but mine is bad so i can't receive images i don't know i think in one of all a couple of my vlogs i used to show you guys when i when i'm relaxed in the house like an evening routine i watch tv yes that's because i used to use the decoder to receive images like to get images but right now guys things are so expensive times are hard youtube is hard <laughs> even salaries are hard to come by like they don't pay us like that so things have become very very difficult so i, I I'm, I'm not i cannot afford it anymore so we have you have two options either you use the normal cable or you go for a decoder a decoder is very very expensive so i told the guy to you know put the normal one because that's the one i can afford it's very affordable unfortunately he came and installed it and i just can't receive images so he told me that part is bad i have to fix it guys i was so what did you do me anyways long story short i have to take it to the repairer because <laughs> Is the board done for me poor reception here and the TV is something that kind of occupies our minds you know to keep us company and if that one is not working <laughs> I was just spending my whole day out there and if you have to spend your whole day out there you're gonna be spending money too so it's better you fix this and be in the comfort of your home you get so I just have to do it so I call my dad this morning and he tells me and he told me there's a repairer around where he lives so yeah I just don't and I want to take it there and we'll see how that goes but I know these people are going to murder me hey it's more to go murder me I'll tell you I'll give you guys a gist anyway so that is it I think um, later today I'll have to go to the market and get some cucumbers guys since my holiday started I've just been eating anything and everything no diet I don't even drink water nothing the only thing I'm kind of consistent is the tea I make every morning, my cinnamon, um, my cinnamon ginger, no, not ginger, cinnamon, cloves, and honey that I do every morning. At least that I've been consistent. But cooking, but like, like, I've not been consistent, so I've gained a lot of weight. And when I gain weight like this, I start having the effect. I start feeling the effect on my knee, you know. And I have so much belly fat, back fat. In fact, all my body 
it's just fat 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 and it's not funny anymore it's not good for my health so i need to go back to my diet yeah that's it we haven't even had breakfast today next we won't even take breakfast today yeah yeah way <laughs> anyway guys let's go it's almost midday hopefully they get to fix it today and um, yeah so Elder sea sitting, even if you climb the highest hill, you will not see. Man, is the end of the road. Wait till the end of the road. Now go, the go. Now go, the go. Now you go, now. It's going to get you. Now you carry on. So we have dismantled the TV. I have to take this off. Okay, so this is the part where it is bad. So I have to replace this. As you guys can see, antenna or cable in. So this part is bad, this is what we're going to be fixing today. Oh God! You guys, guys, I'm feeling the sharp pain on my navel area. I don't know if I can go through this, but I just have to because... <sighs> yeah, it's so pain. Ay, ay, ay. Jesus, save my soul, Mama. Oof. Guys, ah, hi God, I've never felt this kind of pain before around my belly button area. If you hear any noises, the fan, my dad's fan is so loud. Hi God, who did I offend? Who did I offend? Hi Jesus, my my junior brother have gone to the TV repairer and he asked me to call him if any emergency. Guys, I've never felt this kind of pain before. I don't know, last night, I ate very late, around 2.30 a.m. I was so hungry. You see why I tell you people, I don't eat healthy these days. I might, in fact, I don't know. Maybe it's the effect, but guys, I woke up this morning. I was so fine. I was so strong. Just when we were about leaving the house to, to the repair, I just started feeling these pains. I drank water before leaving the house. It subsided for a minute. My junior brother reminded me of this thing that we used to do when we were kids. I don't know, as a Cameroonian, <laughs> when you have issue with your navel or your belly button area, you take your saliva and apply it there and it will stop immediately. So, oh my God, I did that. At some point it stopped though. After about 30 seconds to a minute, it just started pain again. I could not move. I was just praying that let me get there and lie down. When I got here, my dad asked me to lie or to lie down on my belly, but on my stomach, I could not. I could not. It was that bad. I drank water again, and now he has given me a bicarbonate of soda, and we diluted it, and I drank. Hey, I feel better, but from time to time, I still get those pains around there. So I don't know if it's gastric or the fact that I ate very late in the night. I just don't know. But if it gets really, if it gets bad, I will have to go to the hospital. Hey, that's an update, guys. I'll just have to lie down a bit. And, yeah. One hour later.
honest, I don't understand this kind of weather. It is so hot, it is sunny, at the same time, it's rainy. I like it, I don't understand. What's going on here? This guy has been reading since he got here. Good job, good job, man. That's good. I wish I had a before and after, but this area used to be so bushy. This is like my dad's backyard. I'm telling you, you know, tell me so you do in the weed. <laughs> I beg my come up for rain before rain wash me. <laughs> Guys, this he has been working. I tell you. Remember this of rain before sun be shine, Bumazi walk for bush. Now, Simon did the run walk for you about two hours ago. I could not talk like this. Thank God for life. Later that day, hi guys, what's up? This is like 5, 5 pm, and I feel much better. So, ooh. Okay, I'm heading to the market to get my cucumbers I told you earlier today and my TV has been taken home. Guys, I'm going to just see, apart from the fact that I suffered serious stomach ache, but I feel like the money I spent today also contributed to that stomach ache. <laughs> Anyways, we're going to chat about that, but let me rush to the market now because the market closes at 6 and I have to pick up my dress at my tailor's place i was supposed to pick it up in my last vlog but i got home really late and the lady closed at five so i could not meet up so yeah from the market i will move over to her place and collect my dress because i really need to do this haul tomorrow guys i really need to do it so yeah let's go and when i get home i'm going to gist with you guys how everything went to my tv and hopefully it works so yeah that's the update let's go I'm so happy that my TV now plays and it now shows images without me using a decoder. Guys, I have just four minutes until my memory card gets full. So I have to say this very quick. I'm about to end this vlog by the way. So I got the cucumbers. I also picked up my dress from the tailor and I made a very quick stop at Santa Lucia, as you guys have seen. So how much I spent to repair this TV? Oh God, thinking about it, I'm like, Jesus. I need a man <laughs> guys I spent 30 thousands as well 30 thousands hey I did not plan to spend this much I told you guys now small thing like that in this duala is like nothing is small in this duala honestly but something you feel like no it's gonna cost about two thousand five thousand or ten thousand at most guys I spent 30,000 francs everything was bad and the cost of it is thunder so thunder destroyed that part uh, on the TV right so that's the reason why I could not have images like there was this interior so my, my dad was explaining it to me I was just like okay I'm, I'm getting you I'm getting you because at that point my stomach was also paining me I'm like Papa beg you do anything one do one big at this point I'm not even understand what you're saying but the cost of it is thunder strike so they have installed like an anti thunder something that whenever thunder strike is not going to affect because for the most part that is how most appliances get back get bad in cameroon thunder this is the thunder so if person say you thunder just that boss you cry because it will destroy very highly if that's anytime it gets rainy or thunder starts striking it's not going to affect my tv so i am safe so that's one of the reasons why it costs that much because i have to repair and look for a new uh port for it i don't know i'm just calling it but i don't even know what is called sha I had to replace it i had to buy the thunder the anti-thunder uh, regulator so yeah i thank god for everything i thank god for providing me the means of 
preparing my TV. Anyways, guys, that's what happened today, and I'm going to end this vlog here. I need to look for something to eat. I'm so hungry. I need to drink a lot of water. I need to go back to eating vegetables and fruits because I suffered from constipation. Guys, do not sleep on constipation. It can kill. Like I feel like my ancestors wanted me back. Like they were calling me in the land of the like to join them. <laughs> I don't know. Like, I'm sick at this point, but. That was how I felt guys. I felt so I was in pains. I was literally in pains and thank god like the little things you have at home. Hey, let me just show you. This is what healed me. I mean God saved me, but this is what healed me. Bicarbonate of soda. I just needed a teaspoon and that was it. So whenever you're suffering from constipation, please this should be your cure. Except it gets worse that you have to cause you have to seek medical attention. But this should be your first aid. My memory card is blinking. That will be the end of today's video. Hope you enjoy watching. Stay blessed and stay safe. Don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and all that good stuff. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.